that is my next project. My next project, it was uh, actually, this is my new little setup for now. It's, this is uh, my mother-in-law's place and I'm out of the army, so we're kind of in a little bit of a transition period. So this is where we're staying for a little while. And uh, she actually had a piece of art on her wall and I'm going to transform it for her. And I just showed you what that is. I just had. It was, it was in a frame. So here's a glass, super dirty. Here's the frame. So it's on this, um, it's on this sheet of paper, or this sheet of paper was um, here. So this is like an old print, just this old, you know, I guess you might have bought this from wherever. I don't know where it came from, honestly. It's just a print, just on a sheet of paper. Just to, and what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to draw on the back of this thing and uh, reframe it and put it back in her house. And she gets a little piece of art from me, you know, so I'm going to be using these Posca pins. I'm going to get to it and see what we come up with. Let's find out. Life has changed so drastically within the last, like, week or so for me. And it's, um, it's something we've been honestly waiting for since about February. But like I said earlier, I am out of the military officially out and I moved back home back home to Mississippi where I was born and raised and uh, where my wife is also from and yeah so we're basically starting a new life essentially you know we've only we got we met each other before I joined the military and uh, I got um, I joined the military after I'd met her I'd been with her for um, almost a year and then we got married almost a year ago now set um august 31st we'll make a year and so this is our first time being married and being out of the military and having essentially the freedom to do whatever the heck we want to do really um and of course we're gonna have to find jobs we're gonna have to find you know a way to make money we're gonna have to do things um to support ourselves we're gonna have to find a place to live and but right now we're kind of piggybacking off of family, so we're we're really blessed to have access to that, access to family, which is cool. Um, so that's that's super neat. But life's changing, man. We're we're you know I look myself in the mirror and I ask myself, what in the world do I want? What do I want out of life? And I told myself I want to become an artist. I want to make art a career. So that's exactly what I'm doing. And uh, yeah, I've got you know stuff to look forward to. And my wife, she wants to, um, she has an interview at the zoo, at the local zoo. She's going to start volunteering at the zoo. So that's something, her big dream is to own a zoo one day. Uh, so she wants to be around animals, and that's exactly what she's going to do, which is cool. So we're making moves. We're doing exactly what we want to do. We're doing, you know, life's, life's good. Life's great. So, you know, the military has been good for us, but it's been good to me. But it's time to go, and uh, now that we're gone, it's we're taking advantage of. We're just taking advantage of the situation. So, uh, side note, I zoomed in a little bit here and uh, intentionally left it, um, you know, normal speed, not sped up way. Because I, when I watch YouTube videos, when I watch people make art, I like to watch it real time instead of like choppy and skippy around and make a couple lines and whoop there's a final product no I like to I like to get zoomed in close and personal with it and I want to see what they do and the movements they make and also that's kind of my intention here is just to show you that you know this is this is real time this is what it is so if you're into that that's cool uh, I know when I watch a Mark Crilly video if you haven't seen Mark Crilly Mark Crilly is cool he's in he's an artist on YouTube but uh, he'll he'll <laughs> He'll fast forward, you know, he does some live and then he'll fast forward into it. And every time he fast forwards, I'm like, no, don't do it. Just stop it. So <laughs> here's a little glimpse of me just drawing real time. And uh, honestly, this isn't the best piece I've ever produced. I've just, you know, really, it's the first real project that I've 
accepted since I've been back home, and that's that's okay. So uh, I'm just taking it easy right now. Um, I'm working in my sketchbook a lot. I've got you know probably about four or five spreads done now in the whole sketchbook, and uh, working on some pretty big projects. Working on some cool stuff. Working on some some art. Some art. Uh, here pretty soon, I'm going to start taking. Uh, commissions again once I get nice and settled and get a consistent space to make art which is awesome so um, yeah yeah like I said life's good life's great life's looking up for us it's hard it's tough I'm not gonna act like it's perfect uh, life is a little bit stressful because of this transition period but it's it's life such is life right you're gonna run into speed bumps you're gonna run into obstacles but you got to overcome them and keep going and create that dream of yours right and that's ultimately what we're doing I'm coming up on the end of this video this is the original frame that this print from 1995 came in and uh, here I am I'm gonna hang it up in this exact spot where it came from I pulled it right here this is where it came from and this is where it will reside yet again so hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time subscribe if you want to and I'll see you later thanks